So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. The teams then, Belgium against Egypt. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beck. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. And already we're underway here. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? I would say Jan Vertonghen. Whether it be at centre-back, full-back or wing-back, he's comfortable on the ball and, and likes to step up the pitch and, and take the odd risk. Um, he needed to add aggression to his game, and he has. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. He's managed to get himself offside. And then he... Now the pass. That's a pop! Oh, surely that deserved better. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Egypt have really got the wind in their sails, and I'm not sure whether this team has an anchor. Maingalan. Lukaku. Out wide to the right. Looks to slip it through. Lukaku. Referee's had a good look and given a corner. Goes straight through to the keeper. Mohamed Salah. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Now it's De Bruyne. Now it's Azar. Going through. Looks like a good ball through. Lukaku finds himself offside. Yeah, he was off. Ever so slightly, but he was off. Tries a through ball. Elneny has a hit! Too close for comfort.
De Bruyne. Now it's Lukaku. It's Lukaku! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah. Now surely. Goes wide. Battles to win it back. It's one! Their attempt, just the wrong outcome. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. He's gone for a throw-in. So it is still nil-nil. Who's he going to play in? Crosses it in. Or fists it away. Now it's Lukaku. Hazard. He's left his man. It back. Shikabala. Now the pass. Mohamed Salah. Shikabala has a swing at it. Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. Promising move, that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Played out to the right. El Nenny. Still waiting for the... He hits it! Lukaku goes up and over. Mertens looking to get on the end of this. He's got away. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Passes it through, and he's cut it out. De Bruyne. It's Lukaku. Now it's Azar. Now England plays it out to the flank. Mertens. Azar. Can he score? A really close shave and the last action of the first half. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Five minutes, it is still goalless. Change perhaps after half time. We're properly into the second 45 minutes. Egypt can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose. Tries a header! Nick with his head, but couldn't steer it in. Listen, the manager seems to have impacted during the break. This is now a show of real purpose. Mernier, Hazard. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Tries a through ball. Hazard. And it's Lukaku. Nyingalan. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Lukaku. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. El Neni. That's a throw. They're 
actually not getting too tight. He'll hit it! He's done very well to get to that. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Played out to the wing. Oh, good interception. Mohamed Salah is effectively being marked out of the game here. Well, he's a, a source of potential trouble, so tight marking just has to be done. Over hits and out of play. Company goes looking. Salah. Looks like a good ball through. Shikabala. It's out for a goal kick. Mernier. And it's Azar. It's a loose ball. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Brings it forward. Cooks out to the wing. Shikabala with the... And a header! He will be livid with himself. Mohamed Salah really has shown an example of why indecision is fatal. De Bruyne. Well, it probably an entirely one-sided game, still up for grabs. Nothing to show for all the pressure. Into the channel. Gets his foot in there. Shikabala. Now the pass. For Tongan. Oh, he's taken out. That'll be a foul. Egypt look as though they're about to make a change. De Bruyne pushes it out wide. Some good play on the left hand side now to profit from it. Lenny. Egypt merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. And it's Lukaku. Azar. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Looks to slip it through, and he's there to cut it out. Pops it into the area. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Lukaku... Plays it out to the flank. Now it's Azar. Witzel. Now it's Mertens. And the weighted pass. Carrasco. Ferreira Carrasco delivers. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Deftly. Great leap! That is wonderful from Lukaku! And you can't but admire that from a player from whom we expect to come to the fore at crucial, crucial moments. Doing it, however, is another matter, and his influence just grows and grows. He produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch, and importantly, it is a strong end product. Belgium take the lead. Now it's just a question of holding on. 
Well, the last moments now, Peter, are going to be very frantic. There's still time for a, a twist or two yet. Egypt need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. And it's Lukaku. It's a good foot in there. And that is that. So it ends 1-0, an enthralling game and an agonisingly narrow defeat. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Egypt were brave in standing up to much-fancied opponents and this can be a real source of confidence and a date to remember now.